Member for Richmond South Centre. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. Last Saturday, March 2, 2024, I had the privilege of joining over 70 volunteers at Richmond Garden City Park to help remove invasive species <clears throat> Himalayan blackberry bush. This annual event, hosted by my office, was implemented in collaboration with the City of Richmond's Parks Department and the Garden City Conservation Society. Although invasive, blackberries offer certain benefits to our community and local environment. As a food source, many people enjoy an abundance of blackberries. Additionally, some ground nesting birds and small animals benefit from a thick and thorny canopy. Unfortunately, the blackberry bush poses a major threat to local plants. Blackberries can grow their canes up to five meters and pull down large trees. The dense canopy also blocks sunlight, which is much needed by low-growing plants. The proliferation, resilience, and aggressive growing growth pattern allow a blackberry to outcompete local plants. Unable to fully eradicate the blackberry bushes, volunteers and I were able to systematically clear a large area while keeping the spread of a blackberry bush under control. On March 23rd, volunteers and I will return to the same site and plant 700 trees to help create a micro-urban micro forest, also known as the Miyawaki Forest. These mini skewer forests are mighty, containing hundreds of plants, each striving to get its own share of rain and sun. Done the right way, the forest achieved mature height in about 20 years rather than 100 or more, because they grow up rather than out. All plants are local and evolved to live together. Plants chosen to form four structural layers, canopy, subcanopy, uh, arborescence, trees, and shrubs. I want to thank all the volunteers for the contribution and dedication, Richmond Parks Department for providing equipment, support, and guidance, Garden City Conservation Society for the leadership and expertise, Linda Lee for her generous do donation to help our society to purchase the plants, by working together, we can build a better Richmond for all to enjoy.